Hey guys, welcome to my new vlog. So today I'm in Haridwar as you can see. It was not any planned uh, tour for me. I went to Kedarnath and while coming back I am just coming through Haridwar to New Delhi. Uh, so after a long time I have come to Haridwar. To be very frank, when I used to come in Haridwar uh, in my childhood, the, I, I, I was saying that this uh, water was pretty clean that time. I mean every time the water color used to be very much blue. Right now it is very much muddy so I asked to the people that what is happening to this water. So they were saying that uh, before one day of Diwali they will be you know, cleaning the water and the water will be clean again you can see. So first of all I was like you know uh, a little bit scared to see this scenario. Uh, after a long time I come to Haridwar and I really love this place yaar. Really, this is very divine, this is very, uh, you know, uh, uh, what to say, uh, very peaceful and very religious place, uh, I must say, and you will love that. There is a lot of attraction in Haridwar, I cannot cover it all, but I was thinking to give you an overview through this vlog, uh, so that you can uh, get some idea, like whoever hasn't uh, even come to, you know, uh, Haridwar, they will be knowing that how is it looking like, what are the things you can find over here. Uh, so that is my purpose to create this vlog. So keep watching guys. So first of all, Haridwar mein aate hi, people are saying like, please uh, Ganga Pani bhar ke leke aao. Uh, dabba mein. So this is the Dabba. You can see and for Pooja, they are using this flower. Ye bhai sab to so rahe. And you'll find one Netaji statue. Oh, okay. People are going, people are using bike in here also. Uh, you can see that Netaji statue here. Okay. And the best part of Haridwar is this is Ganga, and you can find a lot of hotels, like river facing hotels, you can see, right? Price will be a little bit more, I, first, uh, I would say. But uh, you know, you can uh, stay here. There is nothing to worry about the price. All the time we cannot, uh, you know, calculate the price and uh, visit any uh, good places. So this is the thing, and I'll be going to that bridge. I would like to show you the Ganga. When I used to come to Haridwar, I used to see there was no mud here. There was a lot of you know, uh, water flow, but right now you can see this condition. That's why I was a little bit sad. People are taking bath on that side, I'll be going there. And I was trying to find that Aarti Ghat again because after a long time I have come over here. So let's go that side and I can see one clock tower, right? In far you can see, I'll be going there also. Actually, I forget a lot of things in Haridwar. Let's revive my memory again. Let's go guys. In Haridwar, I am going towards the famous one and only Harkipori Ghat where that Aarti has taken place every single evening at 7 o'clock. Yeah, I remember it. Dhanush Pool, it is written. Uh, okay, I find it. So many people you can see taking bath, you know. I have taken bath twice and the water was pretty chill that time. One thing you can see, people are trying to collect the coins from there because very often people throw the coins here, right? And they are trying to find it. They have the magnet in their hand and they are collecting it. You can see that side people are you know taking baths looking like a sea beach, right? <laughs> so guys, finally I'm going to show you the main Harki Pauri Ghat where that evening Aarati has taken place. It's <sighs> looking so nice. Okay. So that side, that is the Harki Pauri Ghat. Evening Aarati has taken place there only. Again, they are collecting that coins, you can see. 
they are digging up the mud and they are trying to find it one by one, like removing those mud, that whether any coins are there or not. It is said that while Samudra Manthan, the celestial bird Garuda carried Amrit in a pitcher and passing by, that time drops of Amrit fall over from the sky in Nasik, Ujjain, Allahabad and Haridwar. So this place become very auspicious. That's why it was called Brahmakun Ghat. Hence, thousands of people take deep into the water of Ganga to wash away their sin or karma and seek for moksha. This is one of the places in India where Kumbh Mela has been celebrated every 12 years and Ardh Kumbh Mela is celebrated in every 6 years. I came to know the broken portion has been previously constructed and they were trying to create two separate pools for up and down lane. After that the Dhanush pool has been constructed and it went pretty well. So previous broken portion has been abandoned. Talking about how it is named Harkipauri, it is said that King Vikramaditya's brother Bharti Hari has meditated on the banks of this holy river Ganga for several years. After his death, the great king built this ghat in his memory. That is why it was named Hari Ki Pauri. Har means Lord Shiva, Ki means off, and Pauri means steps. That's why Harki Pauri is also said to be the gateway to the Lord. It is believed that Ma Ganga visits her parental house on the day of Dashera and returns on the day of Bhaiduj. During that time, due to cleaning, authority dried the water of the river and before one day of Diwali, they release the clean water with full flow. I couldn't notice in my childhood that in the steps of Ghar several temples were built and now I came to know Pandit Hargyan Singh Katara, a Jamindar of Agra in 1938 extended the Ghat area and built the temples and later those were renovated.
another greatest attraction of Haridwar is its massive market area. Oh, bhai, once you visit, I bet your pocket will be getting empty very soon. Those shops will attract you now and then to buy something. Mostly, you will find clothes, religion, salmon, food, and household stuffs. The entire market looks very colorful and photogenic. Most of the shops use online payment nowadays, so carry a big shoppers and start shopping, guys. Talking about nearby attractions, one can visit Manasha Devi Temple, Vaishnu Devi Temple, and Lord Shiva statue on the other side of the river. Another information is Haridwar bus stand and Haridwar railway station is around 2 km away from the ghat so you can easily reach down by walk. Being a Bengali, I always remember Dada Bodhi Hotel for lunch and dinner. By paying 80 rupees, you will find baskati rice, ghee, ghee flavored green chili, beguni, mong dal, pachmishali sabji, alu gobi sabji, chutney, and papar. There are total 5 Dada Bodhi hotels in the row. I went to the oldest one. So that's all for today. See you in another video. Till then, raise humanity and spread peace.